All right, you guys, I ordered the Make That Flav bundle from Milani, and today is our first day at the gym since we went on vacation to Atlanta. So we brought Hayden's flavor, which is the sour kiwi berry, and we're about to try it. So I'll try it. Hopefully then, Hayden wins. Yes, I really like Hayden, but I'm down if Libby wins too. But we're gonna try his as the first flavor. Interesting. Nah. Ooh, y'all, it smells so good. Smell this one? Yeah. Ooh, yum. Okay. Whole scoop. Wait. I'm not doing crack, so half a scoop of crack. Cheers. Mm. Fire. Fire, fire. Fire. Tastes, tastes like Kool-Aid. Okay, Hayden. 10 out of 10, 10 out of 10. I know you gave up your social media, but 10 out of 10. That's yeah, pretty fire. I this also tore my Achilles. So unfortunately, I will not be doing any Olympic workouts, but I'm gonna do a back and buys day today. So I'll take you guys to that workout. And yeah, let's get into it. Okay, so the first exercise I'm doing in this workout is assisted pull-ups on the machine. Um, four pull-ups. My goal is to be able to do five <laughs> unassisted pull-ups by the end of the year. I just haven't focused on pull-ups in so long, so I'm literally back at ground zero. But here I did three sets of AMRAP. Pretty much every set I tried to do above five reps. Here I am doing barbell rows, and this was three sets of 10. That's what I did, but of course, um, you can go ahead and adjust these to what fits best for your goals. But I did three sets of 10 at 95 pounds, which because I haven't done these in so long, actually was, um, it was a little heavy. It was a little heavier than I thought. Um, I'm getting situated to do wide grip lat pull downs. This was actually um, four sets, I believe. I did 15, 12, 10, and then eight. So as my reps decreased, my weight increased. I want to say the highest I went up to was about 70 pounds because, again, this was the first time I've done this in so long. And honestly, it was really challenging. <laughs> Um, and then I decided to superset these with seated bicep curls. Of course, you can do them standing, but I just preferred to sit. Again, less weight on my torn Achilles. So again, I did seated dumbbell bicep curls. I think I had like 10 pounds here. These were three sets of 12 supersetted with the previous exercise, which was the wide grip lat pull downs. Um, like I said, there were three sets of 12. I didn't decrease the reps here. I just kept them all at 12. And then again, just a different angle. We are doing some wide grip lat pull down. And to be honest, you guys, like I said, this is a little challenging. I literally have only done full body every, well, not every day, but pretty much three times a week since October. So it was nice to just focus on upper body. Um, it was challenging. Clearly my faces are showing that, but <clears throat> it was really nice overall. And then I want to say I recorded this on like my 10 reps or my 12 reps. And then I immediately went right back into those seated bicep curls. And I didn't increase the weight on my bicep curls at all. I kept it at 10 for the entire rep. She want me to lock it down, but I told her to pass the key. You gotta slow it. Next up, I transitioned into cable face folds. To be honest, this was actually a lot more challenging than I thought it would be because the bottom of my boot is curved. So it was really hard for me to keep my balance stepping back. Um, so I probably won't do these again with my boot on, but it wasn't too bad. So yeah. 
So I did those, it was three sets of 12. And then again, I supersetted that with some cable bicep curls. And these were also three sets of 12 here. That is gonna wrap up this workout. I will leave the full workout in the description box below. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up and I will see you in my next video. Peace.